chef's kiss baby the gorgeous guys it is a very 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 beautiful curl so this is the unit from icy here guys absolutely gorgeous now obviously this is the same day install guys straight out of the box and on my freaking head so this unit is very very pretty so we're gonna keep it simple in today's hair video guys I'm gonna actually go ahead and leave these curls very nice and soft like this I just feel like it looks very very realistic this is a natural 18 inch density so it's like the perfect curl pattern the perfect density and the perfect length I feel like this looks really good in the winter time like some really nice winter winter curls so kind of like a winter curly wig perfect style guys just the perfect look and I feel like these curls give more of a natural realistic texture like this is kind of close to what my texture would be if my hair was fuller you all know my hair is very very um thin I'm a fine hair girly but this is definitely very very mimicked of uh kinky textured hair so even for my natural girlies out there if you want to put this wig behind the hairline this is a nice 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 texture so with this unit today guys I'm gonna keep it very simple we're just gonna go ahead and close this up right here okay we're gonna add like a little bit of a cut a little bit of a layer close this up we're gonna leave a little bit of this space here add some powder and a little bit of mousse just to keep it kind of rugged we don't want it to look too perfect we want it to still have you know um, purpose like the curls of purpose but we're gonna go ahead and dim this out here add a little front bang layer situation and then that's gonna be the hair video guys all right y'all so the first thing I'm gonna do is just separate a couple of these pieces out especially in the first little section right here and I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of like get this to go forward. I'm gonna use some of my spritz to get it to kind of lay nice and flat without the spritz rolling off the table. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that flat right here, get everything to come forward so we can get a nice little bang situation going on here. I don't wanna comb through with the hot comb, I just wanna kind of put heat towards it to go a certain way because I don't wanna mess the curl pattern up, you feel me? So I just wanna kind of get the curls to land a certain way and we don't want to pull the curls out too much we don't want to keep them too separate we want to kind of keep them you know in their formation like this one right here looks absolutely lovely so i'm trying to keep them that way so i'm gonna go ahead and grab like my little eyebrow blade and i'm just gonna cut the hair in the front at an angle i'm not gonna cut it too short because i don't know how i really want it so that looks cute i'm gonna go ahead and cut this one as well too right here we're gonna keep it simple guys this is the same day install so it's not gonna be anything major but we still want to get the style so I have to add some mousse to this but I'll show you guys how I do the mousse to the bang part there's a particular way I do it that keeps it nice and cute and everything will be nice and unison so go ahead and uh, hot comb this part down some more and then I'm gonna go ahead and grab like hair from right here to close this area in as well too and just kind of keep it messy at the same time we don't want it to be too perfect we want it kind of messy around so that looks really good. So we're just kind of folding this little piece right here. And then again, we're just going to go ahead and do like a nice little trim. Y'all see that? Very simple. Keep it nice and simple. Okay? Okay. And as you guys can see on the sides right here, it seems like they already did a little something to that. So I don't have... Ooh, child! Don't worry. We about to razzle dazzle it up, baby. I was looking down the whole time, but... Ah! She's cute. So that's basically all I did. I just pulled it and closed it. So what I'm going to do now is just spray right here with some spritz. Again, y'all know I've been using spritz. Spritz has been like my spritz. Has, it just works better. I'm going to also spray a little bit up here too. Not too much. We don't want it to look too perfect. We want it to still look a little, you know, so I'll go ahead and hit that up. Don't make it too perfect. We don't want it to look too you know curated so I'm gonna go ahead and grab this again and just push this down in this area so we're kind of just pushing the hair in that direction so I think we're good I don't think I have to cut anything else I don't really feel maybe a little bit on this one just angle this part off right here nothing crazy there you go and I think this side is fine maybe this little piece I want to get scissor happy you know so 
let's keep it simple so what I'm gonna do now is go ahead and grab my spritz and we're gonna go ahead and get these bangs to go in a little I'm actually gonna get my diffuser too just to kind of lift it I want to kind of clean up some of that frizz right here so that we can have it look nice just like the rest of the curls we want it to look like I just did a nice wash at night and left yep mmm love it all right y'all so I got my lot of body coconut mousse so I'm gonna go ahead and really focus up here obviously you guys can see some of the areas are a little frizzy especially this part right here so I'm gonna add some mousse to that curl listen guys I'm not a professional at this I just do the best I can I'm gonna take the rat tail part of the comb and just curl it around the rat tail part just for a second with the mousse on just to hold it in so I can kind of get the curls to formulate like the rest without having to wet the hair. Y'all feel me? I've done this. There you go. So something like that. You see how I kind of gave the curl back? So I'm going to do that in that section with a couple of the curls just to kind of give them back their curly look. That was actually easy. I was afraid it wasn't going to work on camera, but it worked. Hope you guys saw that. So let me do it on this one. So I'm just going to... Put mousse on the hair and wrap it around the end of the rack tail comb and then you're going to spread it out in the beginning and then you're going to scrunch it together and then it should give you a tighter curl so do it like this and then you scrunch it together and then when you pull it apart there you go it gives you the curl like that <laughs> so i'm going to go ahead and trim a little bit of this off at the bottom just because i feel like some of this is like a little bit unnecessary right here just to kind of make this all even. Just trim a little bit of this off. So now this is even and cute. Now, I, like I said, I'm gonna go in with my diffuser and I'm just gonna buff the front of this up just to make sure that all the curls, you gotta kind of see how they're just popping off of the front. But the little method I did was kind of a nice little quick and easy method just to kind of settle everything down. I am gonna spray everything with a little bit of spritz just to kind of seal the entire style in. I absolutely love this, guys. This is definitely gonna be a great year-round wig. It'll definitely work on vacations or in the summer too, just because it's simple and it's cute, okay? So let me go ahead and I'm gonna add like a little bit more mousse to the front area. And then I'm gonna go ahead and use my diffuser just to kind of get the curls to be a little bit more bouncy in the front. They are bouncing, but I need them to scrunch up and bounce. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the diffuser on low heat and let it do what it do. So So that's basically it for today's hair video guys. I think that this came out really, really cute. I actually went ahead and took some pictures and I'm absolutely in love. Now I love a curly unit like this. It's a simple shake and go style unit. I know you guys are kind of like, what's the point of having this one? Because you got lace on here and you not utilizing the lace. You actually can go ahead and turn the style differently so you can actually wear this in the middle part. It doesn't even matter that I cut the bangs. It's still going to look really cute because the unit is 18 inches long. So you can go ahead and do like a flip over method with this one. The parting space on this tune is absolutely gorgeous guys it is a very 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 beautiful curl now obviously if you go ahead and wash this hair out the curls probably will stretch a little bit so it'll give you more hang time but i actually do like the package curls i feel like this package curl this luxe style hair is very very pretty guys and again all i did was add a little bit of mousse to the bang area and just diffuse it ever so lightly on low heat and it look at that guys very very pretty i'm actually very happy with this one i was a little worried in the beginning i didn't know how i was going to style it but i figured just doing like a full kind of bang look is just going to be very easy i did go ahead and use a little bit of my fenty beauty foundation powder in the number 450 just to tap it up here i figured that it was going to need a little bit closer to my skin just because my cap was showing through i did go ahead with a little bit of a, a black eyeliner pencil just to make sure i filled in a little bit of spots because i over powdered it but other than that chef's kiss baby chef's kiss 
very very cute it's just giving very natural vibes and i don't know if it's the blazer that i put on with the necklace but it's just definitely giving a little bit of an elevated look i usually don't go for this look i haven't done a style like this in a long time but it's definitely giving like scissor vibes it's definitely giving like it could be my hair vibes period guys so let me know what you guys think guys i will leave all the information down below guys including a coupon code per usual happy holidays to everyone because i could say that officially right now Happy holidays to everyone, and hopefully you guys enjoy the season. Bye.